The date is March 24th, 2014, and this is a proof of life video for uh, Flexus 2320 uh, Tool ID 3738 for Class 1 equipment. Okay, uh, we're going to start off by uh, doing the tool power up. So let's go ahead and uh, power up our plug and power up our PC. This tool also comes with um, an HP LaserJet 4 printer, which has already been installed and powered up. And uh, we are going to get also turn on our fans. And our heater. It gets a little noisy, but uh, anyways, let's go ahead and uh, start up our user interface and I could do this by hitting in Okay, I already um, pre-measured our f our first measurement on wafer A and these uh, wafers measure 342 megapascal for the demo the proof of life video. Um, I went ahead and started by measuring uh, wafer A. So uh, we're going to be in the process of measuring wafer B and to get to our measurement of about 342 plus minus 5%. So wafer B is already installed. So you can see that our leveling dial has been uh, at 1-0 and uh, the thumb screw is already locked down and it's already pre-aligned. Now let's go ahead and get to our measurement. So what we're running here. See our process program is set to auto. What this does is before measurements it would um, take a quick intensity check between the two lasers and depending on the film which um, laser's intensity is the strongest will be selected for the laser being used. Let's go ahead and close this. Single measurement. Maybe mm -hmm. call this proof life for two. Select. You can hear the translation stage running. Taking a quick measurement. Selected the 670. And we come with a measurement of 339.4, well within our 5% spec. thing left that we can test. It's a very simple machine. Um, it has the printer function. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, print out this little graph that I put out. So you print. Also select to one. And let's do a portrait view. Or no, let's do a landscape. Be a nice print. Yeah.
good old laser jets. So this concludes the proof of life video for the tool ID 3738. It's a Flexus 2320 for class one equipment. Okay, uh, a couple other things I wanted to add to the, the proof of life video, the demo. I wanted to um, point out that this tool has been upgraded to uh, from a 750 infrared laser to the 780 because the 750 lasers are no longer available as far as uh, new units and for um, any tool that that needs new lasers installed and that are running the 750 lasers must be upgraded to a 780 type of laser 780 nanometer laser so um, just want to so show a little differences here is um, this has changed. Let's see. Let me do a quick laser intensity check. And this um, for the another thing I wanted to demo was the the communication between the heater stage, the earthworm, and um, uh, how the computer controls that. So uh, I had to change out the wafer to a, a test wafer that I normally run and it's already installed so you know, as far as uh, doing heated measurements you like to put on the heater cover and then also you want to make sure that your fan is running and this keeps the heat from rising to the top chamber where the translation stage is so, so you can see here on our, weight, on our laser intensity checks, instead of now, instead of saying 750, now it says 780. And this is our 780 laser intensity check right now. And this is our 670 laser. Right now, you see our position is going to be a little bit off, but uh, that's fine because this is not a bare silicon wafer. This is a test wafer that's been heated so many times, and I'm sure there's some warpage to it. And I just use it for uh, heated measurements for testing out the communication. So earlier um, for the test, I, I went up to 300C, but for this demo, we're just going to go to something really. Someday we could do a, a really quick measurement and uh, just to prove out our our operation here. Let me actually pull up a recipe and do this heat demo. And it's just going to be two measurements, uh, one driving from, I'm going to be driving it up to 35 and then also 40C. And you can see the communication between the two, the, the computer and the urethane. Hard to do while holding a camera. You can imagine that. So, so when I hit measure, it's you'll see it's going to start driving our. It's going to change our urethane numbers. See the bottom number is at zero. It's actually cooling down right now. I did this a little earlier, so now the stage is still cooling. Up. But it's going to drive with our heater turned on. When I say it's measure first thing it's going to do is try to drive it up to 35 and it's going to give it a, um, a ramp up time of about one minute to give it time to ramp up to 35 and the next one will be also going up to 40 and you'll see the communication between the two so let's go ahead and do this let's say measure now you'll see this come up 
So you can see that is changing along with the bottom number on our urethra. So it shows communication between the computer and the urethra. So because this is a, at a time priority, it's going to take a measurement regardless if it makes it up to 40 because it takes a while for it to, to drive up the heater. So after a minute, it's going to take a measurement. You can see it, it's trying to drive it up. It's going to start taking a measurement now. So it didn't quite make it to 35 because of the time priority the setting. And I'm just uh, trying to do this as fast as possible just to show the proper operation of the heater. She says our experiment is going to end in about a minute and 30 seconds. I'm going to pause at this point and come back when the last measurement is about to complete. Be right back. Okay, as you can see, it took another measurement. And actually, according to this graph, it actually reached 35C. The first measurement brought, it went up and took a measurement at 33C. Right now, our computer is controlling the urethrum. The urethrum is indicating it's driving the stage up to 40C. So, see right here, it's about to take another measurement. And it should say about 39C on the graph. So that should do it for the proof of life video, and that's for uh, tool ID 3738 and it's a Flexus 2320 with a 6 inch stage.